Hi, James here. Recently I've been making these spiral marbles for my game and I realised how easy it was to make these in Blender. I just thought I'll show you how to make a spiral or a spring in Blender and just how easy it is to do. It's super easy and it'll only take a couple of minutes. First of all we're going to delete the default cube because we don't need it. Then we're going to go to add and we're going to add a curve and that curve is going to be a circle. I'm also going to go to add. I'm going to add an empty. I'm just going to use the plane axes. Next thing, click on your curve. Go to the spanner tool and you're going to want to add screw. Now I'm going to change this to the Y axis and then you're going to want to give it some distance. And at the moment it doesn't quite look right, that's okay. So for the axis object, grab your little eyedropper tool and pick your empty. Now select your empty and you just drag out. And now you have a spiral. If you go back to your curve, you can just turn up the iterations. And there you go, you have a screw. Nice and easy. A few things to note about this is you can go and grab your curve. A few things to note about this. You get your curve and tab into it. Scale it up. You can make it fatter. Or thinner. You can also just adjust the points if you want. Make it flatter. And so essentially you can make any side, any shape you want with this. The other thing is if you don't use the full angle, you can get some other interesting and weird results. So like this is more of a long sort of telephone cordish screw. But yeah, just experiment and there are all sorts of things you can do with this. And most importantly, you can make springs really quickly and easily. So I hope you found this useful. If you did, please like, subscribe and comment. It really helps me grow the channel and makes it so I can make more videos. Hope you have a great day. Bye.